Hulk Hogan says, stop hating on Snyder. Okay, screw you. Uh, oh, by the way, ban, ban him. Ban that Hulk guy. Hulk Hogan, what's his name? Let me look at you. Uh, welcome to the ban team. Get off my channel. Wonder Woman is, is an amazing film, and we all know it. She's the savior of the DCEU. Hashtag Patty Jenkins from Man of Steel 2. You guys already know this, but I got a freaking bone to pick. Please come with me and take a look at this mother freaking image. Look at this image they just released for the Justice League. Patty Jenkins' Wonder Woman is completely different from Zack Snyder's Wonder Woman. Truth. Tell me the truth. The truth, motherfucker. You actually have a character in this very image who looks terrified, who looks like she's hiding behind Batman. Only one that looks good is Batman. You god dang straight, do you know why? That's Snyder's boy. This is a Snyder film. Zack got her sideline. Patty Jenkins knew what Wonder Woman was about and gave her justice, and Zack Snyder's pushing her down a freaking tube. I've killed things from other worlds before. Thank you, Joss. Please make the reshoots. I understand why. I understand why Joss Whedon took over this film and added reshoots and called Wonder Woman and said, "Get her over here quick." Joss enters. Here's Joss. Okay, quick. All right. Well, Zach is gone. Let me take over his shit. What does he have? Jeff. Jeff, we have a freaking problem. No, it's worse. It's worse than what you thought it was. This motherfucker lost his freaking mind. He got Wonder Woman at all crazy grayscale, colored the freak out. She's sidelined. Freaking call Diana. Get the freak over here and do these reshoots. You see him building sets. You saw the images. Big, huge sets. The Hall of Justice. He's building shit. He's building these multi-million dollar sets to fix this trash movie. Tell me lies. Tell me sweet little lies. People who loved Batman vs. Superman and didn't see the issues with that film, they're mentally challenged. People who loved that film have issues somewhere or biases somewhere. And that's not good. We cannot recover from what Snyder has done to this universe if we don't stand together and say this is bullshit and call this shit out for what it is. We need to keep in our minds and understand Patty, Jeff Johns, Joss Whedon, they're going to take this into a better direction. We need to keep that in our minds. And that's gonna be the, 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 the inconsistency in the film. You can have Joss Whedon making Wonder Woman iconic. And then you're gonna see some scenes where she's like, what the freak, she's dumbed down. That's Zack's Wonder Woman. Omar says Black Widow got more uh, love from Disney than any DC character from Warner Brothers, except for Batman. You ain't lying. Cause I'm a liar. Yeah, I'm a liar. And these fake movie reviewers who are being bought, paid, and are, don't have their own brain and mouth to speak on the truth of what they believe in, and they misguide you all. What's up, Jody's first what's time up? on Heroes. Good to have you, man. Thank you. Oh, y'all making me feel good. YouTube yeah. was good. It's your boy Jody Joe, and I'm on Collider Heroes, baby. Yeah. That's right. Ronan the Accuser. Well, you know what I'm saying? Let's put spec on his name. You heard it here. Uh, as far as the Shazam, the Shazam movie is concerned, I'm not too excited about it because I think it's a little early for us to even get a Shazam within the DC FU. Right. But, uh, <laughs> That's what I want the DCFU to be about. I want it to be have a foundation of good movies, universally good movies, with Wonder Woman and Aquaman, rather than with the DCEU when it had Man of Steel, which is okay, and BVS, which I didn't like too much. Right. So the foundation needs to be solid when it had Man of Steel, which is okay. There's people out there that actually like that z emo, emotionless, zombie, robot, sad, depressed, washed out, dark Superman that they call Henry Cavill. When it had Man of Steel, which is okay. Nigga, Henry Cavill is not a good actor. And he's just having fun with it, man. Shout out to Henry Cavill. He seems like a cool guy. In this dark, gloomy, plasticky, shiny bullshit that was Man of Steel's costume. We just we just keeping it 100 here, bruh. We just keeping it 100. You look amazing, Diane. You look so beautiful. Say hi to my subscribers. She's a beauty. We loved you in Wonder Woman. You're amazing. You look gorgeous. Wow! Say hi, Amber! Say hi to my subscribers! Amber, you're amazing! Say hi to my subscribers! We're live! Say hi! We're live! There she is! Ben! And what's up, Ben? You the man, Ben! You the man, Ben! Gal! Right here! Gal! Gal! Gal is Jody! Gal! Henry! Superman! Superman, what's up, bro? Shout out to you, bro! 
nigga, Henry Campbell is not a good actor. And it is Justice League movie review time, baby. <laughs> Once he came back, my God, Henry Cavill is Superman. <laughs> Henry Cavill is Superman. Oh, dear me. Seeing him, seeing him in this film brings such joy to my heart. The, the lighthearted, bright, hopeful, he was amazing in this film. Superman has returned. I'm proud to give Justice League a B minus. Exceeded my expectations, almost a full letter grade. Go watch Justice League. I don't make this shit up. I'll lie again and again, and I'll keep lying. I promise.